Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Back in February 2021, during the Aero India show, HAL has showcased its CATS or Combined Air Teaming System. The CAT system consists of Hunter and air-launched Wingman, the Alpha and air-launched Swan drones, the Warrior, the Loyal Wingman and Infinity Pseudo Satellite. Today there is some good news related to the development of the Infinity Pseudo Satellite which is now being called as HAPS or High Attitude Pseudo Satellites. As per reports published in the Hans India, the Hindustan Aeronautics Limited HL is developing a futuristic high attitude pseudo satellite with a startup company to strengthen the country's military strike capabilities. The approval for this project is still pending and it's expected that HL will soon get the official note for the development in this month. Once the HL gets the approval for this project, it will take another 3 to 4 years to develop HAPS before it can be inducted. The work on its design has already been started by the HL. This development is seen as a giant leap of technology. If we talk about HAPS, it's going to be an ultra high altitude solar powered pseudo satellite. The HAPS will weigh close to 500 kgs and can fly continuously in air for over 2 to 3 months and can cruise at an altitude of more than 70,000 feet. It will have an array of solar cells to power it. The secondary batteries will get charged in daylight to power the overnight flights. This enables the HAPS to go deep inside the enemy territory without the fear of getting detected due to its high altitude operation and no propulsion as it uses the solar cells to carry out its operation. It is a first of its kind project in the world where a manned aircraft will operate within the boundary and the unmanned aircraft will enter the enemy zone and can strike out deep inside the enemy territory. This is going to be a great boost in the Indian Armed Forces ISR that is intelligence surveillance and reconnaissance capability. It is designed to be in the class of Zafire Solar Electric Stratospheric Unmanned Aerial System. HAPS can also relay live video feed and images to ground station during an operation. The new drone will be equipped with a synthetic aperture radar for monitoring activity deep inside the enemy territory. Using its advanced sensors, the drone will be able to coordinate with other Indian drone systems such as Warrior, Loyal Wingman Drone, Alpha S, Swan Drones and Hunter Missile. Apart from the military use, the HAPS can also be used for humanitarian assistance disaster relief operation. It can also facilitate 4G and 5G communication in the remote areas and especially in tough terrains with high altitudes such as Ladakh. Airbus Defense and Space has also unveiled Zephyr S which is a next generation HAPS in the Farnboat Airshow. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.